John, really good results over the past couple of weeks. Good performances from you as well. All good things to take into Gillingham at home on Saturday. Yeah, definitely. Um, I think we've performed really well. I think we have been performing really well in previous games, just not getting the results. So it's good to get the results as well. And for you as well, it's not just about being uh, amongst the goals, but, but the assists as well. Do you enjoy that part of the game as well, make, making those goals for other players? Definitely. I just want to help the team get the three points, whether that's scoring, assisting, playing well, whatever it is, just it's nice to, to be a part of it. And you've had that combination um, with Samson over the, the past few games as well. How's that been linking up with him and, and how much can, can you help him on his sort of starting out in the, the journey and how much does, does he help you? Um, I think, like you said, we help, help each other. I try to give him as much advice as possible. But he's a great player in himself. He's just really good, really um, real handful to play uh, for the other teams against. So, no, it's been yeah. joyful. It's, um, Really enjoyed it. Every time we have spoken on BBC Essex to Matt Bloomfield about your performances, he's often said um, that he's, he's spoken to you and he said he doesn't want you to be a, a superstar, but he wants you to be there starting <laughs> and making impact in games. What, from your point of view, have those conversations been like? And, and, and is that kind of how you were feeling as well? That you wanted to be there right from the start making an impact? Definitely. That's what the gaffer said as soon as he came in. He doesn't see me as someone that comes on. We've played together before, he knows what I can do and he just wants to bring that to the table and we were on the same page. So yeah, it's really, really happy to get that opportunity and, you know, repay that faith. It's uh, Gillingham, one of your, your former clubs again on Saturday, not that long since since you last played them and, and had them as well in the um, the uh, EFL Trophy as well. Mm. So you've come up, them, up against them a couple of times already this season, but obviously they've, they've changed a, a bit in the past couple of weeks. They've been busy mm. in the transfer window. Do you expect them to still be a, a League 2 club next year? Um, only time can tell in terms of the, the League 2 part, but um, like you said, they've made good signings over the last few weeks. So we just got to be prepared that it's going to be a tough game, you know, um, in the position that they're in. We, everyone wants the points, so it's not going to be an easy game. And we just got to take each game as it comes and obviously chills and try and get the three points.